Hello, friends, and welcome to our lesson 28 slash 29 reading lesson. So today for Wit and Wisdom, for our time with Skytree, we are going to do our writing task about our book Skytree. So yesterday when we were talking about what was happening in Skytree, we used a timeline. So in our timeline, we talked about what happened in the summer with the tree and the sky, what happened to the tree in the fall, what happened to the tree and the sky during winter, spring, and then it finished at summer. So in lesson 28, we were going to talk about how our pages tell us when the next season is coming. It used season words, and we saw this in the book. It would tell us when the next season was coming. So the author would use words like summer, autumn, winter, and spring to tell us when the next change was going to happen to the tree. For lesson 29, Today, we are talking about how does the sky tree show the cycle of seasons. So cycle is a word that means a series of events that repeat. Remember yesterday I talked about holidays and how holidays repeat year after year. So just like seasons, there is a cycle with the change in weather. So when we are talking about seasons, we're talking about changes in weather, changes in nature, and changes that people have to make. So today, we are going to do a writing task answering our focus question. How does Sky Tree show the cycle of seasons? Okay, remember for our information informative paragraph, we're going to have a topic statement that answers this question. We're going to have three sentences with evidence. Those evidence are going to start with first, then last, and we will have a conclusion. Remember, a conclusion is just like the topic statement. Okay, so here is what we are going to do together. I'm going to help you get started with this, and then you are going to finish this on a piece of paper, and then you're going to send a picture of it to me in Seesaw. All right, so the first thing that we need for our informative paragraph is a what? A topic statement. So let's look at our question. How does Sky Tree show the cycle of seasons? What is going to be my subject in my topic statement? Who or what am I writing about? I'm writing about Sky Tree. So my topic statement is going to start with Sky Tree. And it says, how does Sky Tree show the cycle of seasons? So Sky Tree is the book and it shows, I'm using that same action word. What does Sky Tree show with cycles of seasons? What is the word that we have been using when we see something different in the seasons? What's that word? Shows the blank in seasons. Shows the change. So I want you to fill that in. Sky tree shows the changes in weather. and nature. So Sky Tree shows the changes in weather and nature during the seasons. Okay, because it wants us to talk about how does Sky Tree show the cycle of seasons. So that cycle is talking about the changes in weather and nature during seasons. Okay, so there is our topic statement, okay? The next part that we need is our three sentences with evidence. And how are we gonna start these sentences? What words will we start with? First, you're gonna tell me what happened first. So look at your organizer first. 
the tree blank first. Actually, tell me the season. First in summer blank, because we're talking about the seasons with the tree. So tell me what happened to the tree and the weather during summer. Then in fall and winter, what happened to the weather during fall and winter? And what happened to the tree because of that change in weather? And we're going to put spring with summer. Finally, in spring and summer, blank. Tell me what happened with the weather and the tree during spring and summer. And then we have our topic statement right here. We have our first piece of evidence, our second evidence, and our third sentence of evidence. What do you need to put at the end? A conclusion. So here is my challenge to you. I want you to come up with your own conclusion. Look back at your topic statement to make your conclusion, okay? Miss Mason is not going to make a conclusion because I want to see what you come up with. All right, smarties, keep that growth mindset. Good learners do hard things. This is challenging. You guys are having to use your evidence to complete these sentences about how does Sky Tree, our book, show the cycle of seasons. All right, smarties, do not forget to start all of your sentences with an uppercase letter. Make sure that your sentences make sense. You end with punctuations. And as always, go back and see if you need to make any changes or add or take away things. All right, guys, happy learning. Happy writing and happy fall.